Public holidays can be added one at a time or imported using a pre-populated list for the specific country. By default, public holidays don't count against employees' vacation allowance, but these holidays can be set to count against the allowance if required by an employer. Let's say you've been asked to set up the public holidays for the North America location. Employees need to be assigned to this group and the public holidays imported using the predefined list in the software. Manage the public holidays under settings. You can find the tab for public holiday groups under the calendar heading. By default, it contains a group called General that could be edited. We'll add a new group for North America and assign the employees in that location to this new group. The remaining employees are in the United Kingdom, so we can rename the general group. The public holiday tab is under the calendar heading. Let's use the import. All you need to do is choose the list for the correct country. Select the required group. Check through the list and import the holidays. Allow a few minutes for the full list to come through. You can change the allowance count and other settings afterwards. And that's how to set up public holidays and groups.